Hi, Kimmy Rolf here with your monthly mainline market update. And I really hope you've enjoyed the summer on the mainline. And as we head towards fall, I want to share some of what experts are discussing in real estate. I have buyer and seller information on the mainline and forecasting for the final quarter of the year. So pay attention as these numbers will impact you if you are looking to make a move. So this report includes all of the median sold prices, inventory, and the borrowing climate for buyers. So let's go ahead and get started. Home prices have remained stable without a significant increase in inventory. And mortgage rates are between that six to 8% within a 30 year averages. And we're seeing a normalization and buyers looking to buy now rather than later in the year. And we recommend that you contact our trusted lenders to discuss available assistance and your particular financial fitness to borrow. Being pre-qualified is the first step and many homeowners prefer it prior to showing. So let's talk more about borrowing first with our mortgage rate report. The 30 year fixed rate is at 6.55%. The 15 year fixed rate is at 5.75%. And a 30 year FHA rate is around that 6.125%. And a 30 year jumbo rate is at 6.25%. And if you're waiting to buy for lower rates, experts are not anticipating them. And again, we recommend getting pre-approved to know your exact buying power. So going ahead now and moving on to inventory in the townships, these are the real estate numbers from August, 2024. Starting with Devon, nine homes were sold last month with a median time on market of 5.5 days. The median sales price in August was $1.2 million and that sales to list price ratio was at 102%. 44% of those homes were sold over the original asking price. In August, 46 homes were sold in Wayne and the median time on market was seven days. The median sales price for Wayne was $900,000 with a sales to list price ratio of 102%. In Gladwin, the median time on market was 168 days with only five homes being sold. The median sales price in Gladwin was $1,700,000 and Gladwin had a sales to list price ratio of 101%. In Villanova, nine homes were sold in August. The median time on market was six days and the median sales price was $1,100,000, and the sales to list price ratio was 103%. And 67% of those homes were sold over asking. In Bryn Mawr, 23 homes were sold last month with a medium days on market of just eight days. The median sales price was $1 million, and that sales to list price ratio was 99%. In Haverford, 10 homes were sold in August. The median time on market was eight days. The median sales price was $1 million and that sales to list price ratio was 101%. In Radnor, the median sales price last month was $1,100,000. There were 28 homes sold with a median time on market of just nine days. The sales to list price ratio was 99%. And finally, in Newtown Square, 33 homes were sold last month with a median days on market of just six days. The median sales price for Newtown Square was $500,000 with a sales to list price ratio of 103%. And 58% of those properties were sold over asking. So if you're considering fall, mainline sales are characterized by favorable terms for sellers and quick closings. And our sellers receive multiple offers and the option to close in their time frame. And even if you're not buying right away, there are rent back programs that buyers are eager to enter. So call me to discuss solutions. We deliver a comprehensive comparative market analysis to see what your home is worth and marketing strategy so your home can be listed in as little as seven days. And our buyers get an overview of the real estate landscape and all of the properties on and off the market we network and that we have access to. So I look forward to hearing from you and remember, Kimmy Rolf sells the main line and local areas.